Welcome to the 5D Academy of Higher Consciousness. I'm Zarathustra, and I'm broadcasting live from Tulum, Mexico. One of the ways in to become free, if you're interested in freedom, if you are in a place that you feel you're suffering, or you are worried, or you are in any way you struggling with your life could be spiritual awakening with being in this place that you experience love and the self not romantic love you're at a place that your mind is quiet it's not agitated all the time there's no spikes in it a place that maybe you want to be really happy whatever is your story wherever you're at whatever is you're looking for maybe you're bored with your life and you're looking for something to entertain you you just look at it and see where you're at with yourself and you be honest with yourself but if you come to me and ask me Zarathustra what should be the attitude and I can only share with you what I've discovered with myself and what has led me to a different kind of a lifestyle, a, a way of being that it's tranquilo, it's relaxed, it's easy, and a way of being that you're allowing things to come to you rather than you forcing it to happen. So is again is a shift of your attention it's a shift of your focus and i'm going to explain this to you i um i have a lot of clients i have uh followers students friends from all over the world from different ages um and what I found with a lot of my people that I work with, um, and I see where they're stuck mainly, is this sense that of wanting to know everything. This sense that you, you need to know what's gonna happen um, with, if you do meditation, or if you take a course, um, how long it's gonna take for your mind to become quiet, how long it's gonna take you to really feel self-love. Uh, if you're doing a training with me, um, when are you gonna get enlightened? When are you gonna be happy? You know, there's this thing, and I'm only using this as an example. This is not the only thing, but this thing that I need to know, I need to that what if I trust life and I jump or let's say I relocate to another country or another place or I move in with somebody or I move out out of my home. I'm married, I you know, I end of my marriage and it's not working and I have to move out. So what's going to happen? How is this going to be? I need to know. Or I'm moving in with someone. Whatever is the story, I'm using these as simple examples to give you an idea. There's something that I encounter with people, sometimes on a daily basis, is that this thing that I need to know, and which is quite opposite when what I discovered is I don't need to know. It's not really, I don't really need to know because something else inside me, within me, around me knows everything. So I can relax and step back and relax in this mode that 
that which is much greater than me, the intelligence that has created the world, that intelligence that turns the day to night, the night to day, brings winter to spring, spring to summer. It makes the planet to turn around itself. And the planet is turning around the sun. And there's a bunch of other planets doing the same thing and none of them are riding, colliding with each other. And also this same intelligence is running your body your heart is working, your digestion system is working, your circulatory system is working, your you're not paying any attention to any of it. You don't think like, okay, in 30 minutes from now on, my heart needs to pump 50 times faster or my, now my pancreas needs to produce pan, pancreatic juices because you're, you're not doing that. Something else is doing it. Something else is in control. Something else is running the show. So you can relax into that by opening yourself, opening your mind, opening yourself from this thing that I need to know, I need to know, I need to know everything. I'm not going to go out on the street uh, because I'm afraid. I'm not going to do this because it's scary. I'm not going to do that because of blah, blah, blah. You slowly relax into, okay, I'm going to trust in this force that it knows what it's doing. I'm going to relax into it. You understand what I'm saying? Are you with me? Yeah? Yeah? So are we on the same page so far? So what we do is simple shift. I'm not telling you that make a major change in your life. I'm not telling you to make a radical move. Okay? I'm just saying simply relax into this other part of yourself that is the grand intelligence and knows all. But this part of you, who you think you are, doesn't know. So this part is like this controlling thing, needs to control everything, needs to know everything needs to control other people. I like I remember I've been around people like or my family like they really need to know what time I'm going to go and what time I'm coming and what I'm doing. In the past when I was in my youth it's like they need to know everything. It's like sometimes you know what? Okay, just chill out. You don't need to know everything. Just relax. Just take a deep breath. Just, ah, oh, just let go. It's okay. It's okay. You don't have to know everything. You can just chill, tranquilo, pull back, relax, shift, change your seat from here that I need to know everything, da, 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 to, okay, you can just relax. Oh. And let life to unfold itself. Let life to show, to show you what's available. On every moment and every day of life, you allow the life to come to you. And it will give you ways, you know, maybe it's not open here, but all of a sudden something opens here. 